In the Gospel at Mass today, the disciples are in a boat, and it is night, and a strong wind blows against them. They're afraid, but then they become terrified. Why? Because suddenly they saw Jesus walking on the water toward them. Wouldn't you be afraid too? Wouldn't you think that it was a ghost? Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki of the Apostleship of Prayer, and do you recall what Jesus said to them? It is I. Do not be afraid. We can be afraid of many things, but ultimately I think all fear comes down to a fear of suffering and death, things that are really out of our control. Here's something Mother Teresa said about suffering. Suffering will never be completely absent from our lives, so don't be afraid of suffering. Your suffering is a great means of love if you make use of it, especially if you offer it for peace in the world. Suffering in and of itself is useless, but suffering that is shared with the passion of Christ is a wonderful gift and a sign of love. Christ's suffering proved to be a gift, the greatest gift of love, because through his suffering, our sins were atoned for. Remember, that the passion of Christ ends always in the joy of the resurrection of Christ. So when you feel in your own heart the suffering of Christ, remember the resurrection has to come. Never let anything so fill you with sorrow as to make you forget the joy of Christ risen.